Hey, what's up guys? Phoenix here, and this video is going to be another card review slash discussion type video, and this time we've got some information on a new TCG exclusive coming out to us for Maximum Crisis' release. Now, we always get these TCG exclusives, but sometimes they're pretty good and sometimes they're not. Now, this one is generically really, really good. It's fantastic. This is Tornado Dragon, which, unlike its name, it's a worm type, which is kind of, you know... <laughs> we're we're sending some mixed singles here, but like we've we've had that sort of stuff happen in Yu-Gi-Oh before. But anyway, Tornado Dragon is a rank four wind worm type exceeds effect monster. It's got 2,100 attack and 2,000 defense, so by no means is it small and easy to deal with with small nonsense without committing into something. And it just is a generic rank four two level four monsters, and its effect is incredibly simple. And its effect is almost exactly the same as one of the simplest, most versatile card texts that has existed in Yu-Gi-Oh for over 10 fucking years. And that is once per turn during either player's turn, you can detach one Xyz material from this card, then target one spell or trap card on the field, destroy it. This card's text is literally Mystical Space Typhoon, except they had to make it into a quick effect for a monster. So this card effect is quick effect. It's a quick effect. I can't, like, speak because of how fantastic this card is. For a TCG exclusive, this is a generic rank four that is not only a decent size. Consider like removal cards like Diamond Dyer and Castell are typically around the 2,000 or lower mark. Like Lightning Chidori is specific; it can remove a couple of cards. It's 1,900. Castell is 2K. Other stuff like that. Things are usually fluctuating in between the 1,500 to 2K mark. And then if you have any bigger than that, you have a, usually a rank 4 that's a lot more niche in terms of its applications. But no, this is super generic and super like non-specific as to what it does. It's just Mystical Space Typhoon, and it's got a 2100 body with a 2000 defense. So it doesn't matter which way you put this thing, whether it be in attack or defense mode, it's going to be large and hard to get over without committing to some certain aspects of your game plan. Those of which might include spells and traps which could fall victim to this card's effect. The fact that we can just summon MST in 2017, yes, thank you. Thank you, please. MST is one of those cards that I always would love to have a monster that's easy to access to summon. Because back row removal is always at a, like, super high value premium of, like, you just need it. You always need it. And it's always, like, against really random stuff as well, where things like this can just become really applicable. Like... Your opponent activates Fire Formation Tanky. You ain't getting that search. Like, you get Tornado Dragons. Like, all these different cool little interactions that come from the fact that this card text literally mirrors Mystical Space Typhoon, meaning that it's super simple, yet it has so many applications. That's one of those things that I love about older cards, like Book of Moon, Mystical Space Typhoon, and stuff like that, is that while they have the simplest card text available, like, considering their time period, they have countless uses because of the intricacies that you could do with them as play enablers, as back row removal, as mind trick sort of nonsense. Like, it's incredibly versatile because of how simplistic those card texts are. And this completely mirrors that. I love this card. I think it's fantastic. I don't think it's insane. I don't think it's overly broken. But I think it's fantastic and could easily become an extra deck staple in any deck that requires rank fours or can make rank fours because i mean the only access we had to removal as far as generic rank fours go was castell and diamond direwolf castell would always usually be dealing with either face up floodgate spell and traps or would be dealing with monster removal and if you were trying to hit face down spells and traps you basically just summoned diamond direwolf and popped it off for itself to pop the spell or trap and hopefully you dealt with something that was meaningful but with this card, this card can sort of replace Diamond Direwolf in that situation where you can just summon this card. It's bigger than Diamond Direwolf as well, so that's a little bit of a plus. And then you can just detach a material to pop the Spell or Trap, keep your Tornado Dragon, and essentially have the exact same situation of what you do with Diamond Direwolf. So it's just, it's a wonderful little fully rounded triangle of removal that we have now. We have Castell for the face-up threats, we have Tornado Dragon for the face-down spells and traps, and then we have Diamond Dire Wolf that can clear almost anything based off the situation, and could also just be used as like combo pieces for stuff like that. I don't know. I think this is fantastic. Like it, We had Grand Pulse for a while, and Grand Pulse, like I was wondering when we were going to get one of those in a rank 4 form, and we finally have one. It's a TCG exclusive coming out in Maximum Crisis, so I'm really excited for this card. I can't wait to 
play this in literally almost every rank 4, generic rank 4 deck that I run. But anyway, let me know what you guys' thoughts are on this card down below. I Again, I think that it's fantastic. I don't think that it's insane. I don't think it is broken. I just think it's very staple worthy. It's a secret rare. So, you might want to pick up one if you can get it for cheap because I easily see this being a staple in any rank 4 based deck. It's a shame that we're getting this now as close to link format as it is. I would have definitely loved this card like a year or two ago to deal with some of the problems that we've had uh, running around in the format as far as floodgates and back row go. But nothing we can do about that now. But anyway, like I said, let me know what your thoughts are on this card in the comments down below. But other than that, as always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe to all that nonsense. Links are in the description of my Facebook and my Patreon page if you want to get in on a monthly giveaway at the end of this month for the people that have supported me throughout April for a box of Maximum Crisis potentially that you could win through a raffle giveaway system. Then definitely check out my Patreon linked down below. Also, if you just want to support the channel, it's the best way to do so. And if you want to get access to my per like, private Discord server where I play people and talk with people on a daily basis for playtesting, for videos, and just talking about random stuff there's like 15 16 other people in there right now that we literally just do nothing but talk like on a daily basis all day if you're interested in that and want unrestricted access to me in chat form then definitely check out one of the reward tiers over there you might find something that you like but other than that if you're looking to buy or sell cards while also indirectly supporting the channel then check out second chance gaming's website which is also linked in the description they are a direct sponsor of me and this channel and i'm a big fan of how they do business what i've had to deal with thus far both their pricing and shipping are both pretty top notch with what i've had to deal with and what i've experienced so definitely check out their site and let them know that phoenix sent you but other than that that is it for this video thanks again for watching thanks for your time as usual again let me know what your thoughts are on this generic rank 4 mst that's a quick effect which is in my opinion fantastic let me know your opinions and thoughts in the comments down below i wish we had this sooner as i've already said do you wish you ha we had it sooner all that sort of stuff but again opinions all that stuff leave them in the comments down below i'm curious but other than that that is it as i've already said thanks for watching and take care guys i will see you in the next video